mining industry is the economic engine of the Democratic Republic of the Congo, a world leader in the production of copper, cobalt, and other precious minerals. The Komodo Copper Company, a Glencore, Jacquemin, Gertler Family Trust joint venture, operates the Komodo Mining Complex and the Cove Copper and Cobalt Mine near the city of Kowizi. Producing its first copper cathode in December 2007, KCC has since ascended to the forefront of copper and cobalt production in the Congo. Je m'appelle Mohamed Nanakaba. Je travaille dans la mine de KCC. Nous sommes dans la mine de Decove. Derrière moi, vous voyez la carrière de Decove où nous exploitons le cuivre et le cobalt. Copper produced by KCC is used in the electrical industry throughout the world and cobalt in batteries and to form alloys. KCC employs more than 4,000 workers. The vast majority are Congolese. They are all essential to KCC's multifaceted mining operations. My name is Dodondu. I'm from Congo. Here we are at B3. It's one of our crusher for Katanga mining. We are receiving the ore coming uh, underground, open pit. And after that, we mill them, we grind them, and we mix with all of the chemical to float and to get a good concentrate. Je réponds au nom de Charles Zouéba Kazabi. Je suis le directeur de la mine. Et aujourd'hui, nous allons visiter avec vous la mine souterraine de Kamoto. Open in 1969, the Komodo underground mine remains a primary source of sulfide ore in Katanga province. After extensive modernization, KCC restarted underground operations in 2007. Nous irons dans l'atelier. Nous allons voir où est-ce qu'on entretient nos bennes, des petites réparations, et où est-ce que nous faisons l'entretien des machines de foration. Nous irons voir aussi un chantier en chargement. Après les chargements, nous allons voir où est-ce que nous déversons ces produits avant de les remonter en surface vers les concentrateurs. Oh, moi, je suis Ilunga Luaba, le coordonnateur chargement transport minéré. Notre rôle, c'est d'évacuer les produits vers l'endroit préférable. Monsieur Mouteba, je suis coordonnateur, je coordonne la chaîne d'extraction. La chaîne d'extraction, cela veut dire j'alimente les concentrateurs des Kamoto en minéraux sulfurés. Je reçois les produits qui, qui viennent des différents chantiers et ça vient en gros bloc. Et ici, moi, je les traite et je, les, je leur donne une granométrie acceptable pour alimenter les concentrateurs de KTC. This is coming from the rock. It's 45% copper content. That's the end of the process here at the concentrator. After that, we send this to Rilu, which is 10, 12 kilometers from here via pipeline. My name is Albert Chilem. I'm the cobalt plant manager for Luilu. Here we are at receiving area. We receive the concentrate coming from KTC. In Luilu, what we do is what we call hydrometallurgy. That means we use sulfuric acid to leach the concentrate and then uh, copper and cobalt passes in solution and the solution containing copper and cobalt is sent to copper electrowinning for producing copper cathodes. Each uh, cathode is placed between two anodes so that we can have a deposit on each side of the cathode. And after a cycle of five days, uh, the cathode has the enough thickness to be offloaded. This is the final product we obtain. And it's copper 99.8 to 99.9%. The Komodo Copper Company's extensive refurbishments and modernizations have dramatically improved the mine's output, positioning KCC as a key player in the Congo's expanding role in the global marketplace. Good.